We're all starting to get worried for Josh. Oh my God, he needs to come on. Josh! <gasps> Good morning, everyone. Today we are in Yahats, Oregon, which I have always pronounced Yakets because it's spelled like Y-A-C-H-A-T-S, but apparently it's Yahats. This coast is really unique because it's not like typical sandy beaches. It's a lot of lava rock, and um, it's really great for tide pulling, and it's just a really unique place to explore. Raya is really eager to go. Are you so excited to go play at the beach, Raya? Yeah. Okay. Let's look out the door here. We've got the ocean over there and there's a big whale out here. We'll walk out and look at it. There's the whale tail right there. And it has a sprout which shoots up water every once in a while. We'll wait for it. And there it is. So yeah, this is where we're staying. We have come to Smelt Sands State Park, which feels kind of weird to say. It's really windy outside right now. I hope it's not this windy all day long. So this is a really rocky beach, and this statue was dedicated to two teenagers who were swept off of the rocks by a sneaker wave in 2011. A lot of people on the Oregon coast get swept away by sneaker waves. They're really dangerous. And it's really sad. Beginning at this state park is the 804 trail. I think it's like two miles long and it's really cool because it used to be like a footpath for the Native Americans and then it eventually became a road, like a county road. It stopped being used as a road whenever Highway 101 was built and now it's just like a really cool trail that hugs the coast. I don't think we're gonna get a chance to hike it today but it would be really cool if we could because I imagine that the views all throughout the whole trail are just amazing. Now we've stopped at the park, which actually has a pretty cool playground. I mean, there's like this huge uh, tree house behind me. And yeah, there's like a lot of cool things I'll show you around in a minute. But the reason we stopped at this park, the main reason is because they supposedly have a boardwalk that goes through some wetlands. And I really wanted to check that out. Let's go check out this tree house. Ryan's going to come in the tree house with me. Josh is sitting over there with Kira because no dogs are allowed in the fenced area. Whoa, we're so high up. Aerial view of the playground. Mary's down there making plush views. <laughs> hey, check this thing out. All right, where do we put our feet? Cause there's only two knobs. Do we uh, both put our feet? one, I don't know. <laughs> we <Wee -hee! laughs> We played at the park for a while, but I was eager to find the boardwalk. No one else wanted to come to the boardwalk with me. I don't know why, it's probably gonna be pretty cool. Oh yeah, this looks so cool. I found it. There's a little birdhouse in the tree and stuff. Wow, this is nice. I guess I'm gonna go this way. See that little beaver? Oh my God, it's eating, it's so cute. I've come to retrieve the kids so they can see the beaver. There he is. <laughs> Isn't it cute? It's is that beaver. so cute, Raya? Yes, eat. He's eating. <laughs> she said eat. Oh, I wish I had my zoom lens. Oh, well, look, it's got some something in its mouth still. Are you sad because the beaver's gone? Mama. The beaver went home. Say bye bye, beaver. <laughs> it's okay, Raya. <laughs> Raya's so upset because the beaver disappeared. <laughs> we have finally made our way to Cape Perpetua. And our first stop is Devil's Churn, which is an inlet where the water just swishes all around and it looks really cool. Where it cooks chasm? That sounds weird. I want to say chasm. Anyway, um, Thor's Well is here and Spouting Horn. All right, so somewhere over here is Spouting Horn, right? It's really foggy, so it looks kind of hazy. Oh, wow. It's like a whale spout. Right? Is that so cool? Yeah. There's a cave right under there. It's really difficult to see it because the sun is right behind it, but you can hear the water rumbling around in the cave like thunder. Oh, here comes a big wave. Watch this. So you can see Thor's well over here is like a big drain pipe. I think some people call it like the drain pipe of the Pacific. And this guy right here is being really risky because that's dangerous. Now Josh is down there being one of the risky people. Those waves out there are getting huge, aren't they, Blaine? Yeah. Whoa, look at that one. 
we're all starting to get worried for Josh. Oh my God, he needs to come on. Josh! <gasps> oh man. <gasps> I think he's stuck on that rock now. You almost gave Blaine a heart attack. I survived. Oh my God. I started, my stomach started hurting. <laughs> I was shaking. I, I like walked Blaine back. had to walk away. He was like, uh, he was about to pass out. He was so scared for you. I that wave like came I and I got scared either. for you too. I was like, <laughs> oh my gosh. Now we're at Cape Perpetua Overlook, which is the highest spot along the entire Oregon coast that's accessible by car. You can see a uh, spouting horn way over there. Here's Devil's Churn right there. Oh, yep, you see spouting horn over there? It's where we just were. Okay, so check this out. This is a rock shelter that was built uh, during World War II. It was like a lookout fort. What is this, Raya? Hello. It's so cool, isn't it? It's like a little house. Yeah. We are back in the room now. We are all really tired, especially me, because what you didn't see today is that I took Kira on like a three or four mile hike. Raya, what was your favorite part of the day? Um, a waterfall. A waterfall? Yeah. Oh, this, th we saw a waterfall on the side of the road. <laughs> that was her favorite part of the day. <laughs> that was like the wimpiest waterfall. <laughs> What was your favorite part of the day? Getting uh, an awesome picture of Thor's well. An awesome picture of Thor's well and risking your life? The wave started to come in and it crashed like all the way up uh, my my hip. And it didn't like knock me back or anything, but I was like, but Then I, I started to head back and I uh, I couldn't get back. I The rock I had used to step over onto the rocks that I were on was submerged. <laughs> yeah, the waves were coming up, the tide was coming in, all the waves were huge. Right before that happened with you, I was just talking about how, oh my gosh, the waves are huge. Merrick, what was your favorite part of the day? I guess when I was recording my post video at the park, which you guys could see at Rainbow Yoshi's on. <laughs> Subscribe to Merrick Rainbow Yoshi. <laughs> all right, Blaine, what was your favorite part? Thor as well. Thor as well? I think my favorite part of the day was seeing the beaver. <laughs> Did everyone forget about the beaver? You remember seeing the beaver, Raya? She's just being silly. She's going to bed. Night night. <laughs> what a grump. <laughs> under the covers so hard she tooted. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. If you liked it, be sure to hit the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching. See ya. Bye, see ya.